How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. Thanks for tuning into Stock Essentials. My name is Alex. We're going to be going over Virgin Galactic Holdings uh, SPCE, which is absolutely getting decimated in the after hours, as you can see here. So it's sitting at under $19 per share, making the one year chart uh, in the red. Um, all time highs for the stock was around almost $60. Um, so there's definitely a lot of room for this company to grow. Uh, it has a lot of ups and downs. Very volatile stock when it does have um, movement. But overall, I do think that this is a good company for the long term. Uh, and why you have to go over why exactly this stock is down 21% in the after hours. Um, so it's dropping on news that they're delaying the beginning of their commercial spade flights all the way to um, the fourth quarter of 2022. Um, so this stock is just getting killed right now. Um, and it could be potentially a good dip buying as long as you're willing to wait out a few um, more months uh, for their commercial space flights to actually take flight. So this is pretty big because they were estimating that in the beginning of 2022 is when they would actually be flying out their commercial space flights, but it's being pushed all the way to the end of 2022. Uh, and with all these delays, a lot of people are really getting speculative. They are thinking that this company is going to continue delaying their commercial space flights further and further. Um, so that's, there's a lot of fear with the stock. Um, so but I do believe in this company and I do think that they will have eventually space tourism. Um, but right now it's kind of shaky. And when times are shaky, it's always the best time to buy because you're getting stocks at a great discount. Uh, $19 per share. Pretty good price point, actually. Um, so they're actually delaying their commercial space flights because they want to work and refurbish uh, improve the spacecrafts um, rather than actually fly its next space flight test so they're trying to improve their stuff improve their spacecrafts and that's pretty good because they want to make sure that nothing goes wrong when they're actually ready to launch um, their commercial space flights so if we take a look at the SPCE the RSI, the Relative Strength Index, is indicating 12.12. Uh, um, and when when an RSA is below 30, it indicates that a stock is under is oversold. So this stock is pretty undersold with an RSA of 12. Um, so I'm going to be buying up this dip actually when the market opens, uh, and I'm going to be doing that through Leap Options, which is far expiration date call options and i'm planning on doing it for the expiration date of 2023 because remember virgin galactic their commercial space flights are going to begin the fourth quarter of 2022 so we want a lot of time on these contracts to uh, basically encapsulate this time frame so if we go to the options chain um now keep in mind the market is not open so the options chain is not going to accurately accurately reflect the pricing um so we're going to be going over to 2023 expiration date either a 2023 or 2024 would be pretty good um the premiums here is going to be a lot less than what you're currently seeing because remember the market is not open it's not factoring into this huge 20 percent drop um so you're going to be able to get these uh, contracts for a lot cheaper so something that i'm looking at is probably like a 20 and probably like an add the money call option for 2023 or 2024 uh give ourselves a lot of time uh, if there is a lot of delays uh, a 2024 expiration date should be more than enough time for this company to actually uh, release their and start their commercial space flights so we want to give ourselves lots of time um, and if the stock sees uh, price points of around, you know, $50, $60 that it was prior, we, you're going to be seeing a lot of money, a lot of returns on these contracts. Um, let's go ahead and pull up an options profit calculator. Um, Profitcalculator.com is a good one. Uh, we're going to be doing a call option. 
uh, ticker symbol SPCE. Uh, and of course, market is not open. So this current stock price is $24, not factoring into that massive dip. Um, so we've got SPCE. The option we're going to be buying is a, for this example, we're going to be the 2024 expiration date. And we're going to be doing, I think we set a 20, was it $20 expiration? $20 strike, I mean. Uh, so we'll do that. Let's calculate it. And we're going to be seeing that if the stock price goes back all the way to $50, we're going to be seeing, we're basically going to be doubling our return. Um, we definitely need to increase this to 60. So if this stock goes to $60, you're basically going to be tripling your money as we can see on this chart right here. Now, of course, the stock price is not currently reflected to options pricing. So it's probably going to be more like um, quadrupling or even 5xing or 6xing your money because these contracts are not going to be costing this much when the market opens. Uh, we, will, we will make a, another video going up over the updated pricings, but my estimate is going to, this contract is going to be probably um, probably around $900, $800. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, so you're going to make a lot of money if the stock goes back up to $50, $60, um, and the best way to play options is to give yourselves lots and lots of time. Uh, these are called leap options, basically call options that expire um, over uh, a year. Um, so it does give you a lot of time. It's pretty safer than just buying weekly call options. Uh, and the other best way would just be buying and holding shares. $90 per share, not that bad of a price. Uh, and once you own 100 shares, you can sell covered calls week over week to the options gamblers uh, and that's a pretty consistent way to make some income so that's about it for this video if it helped you anyway please leave a like comment down below what your thoughts are on virgin galactic and of course subscribe if you're new to the channel helps out a lot thanks for watching